Hello, hello, Screen Fan 1990 again for the second time today. Um, I wanted to do these in separate uh, videos so that I could put specific um, headers or titles on the videos in case anybody was looking for something you know specific. It you know would pop up for them. Um, but this is obviously another unboxing that I'm going to be doing. Um, again, another great score on the Facebook Marketplace. The thrift stores in my area are horrible. They do not have very much. They're very small. And I have gone to dang near all of them in my area and it's kind of disappointing. So I branched out, started looking on Facebook and I searched, uh, like I said in my previous video, you know, all kinds of different terms, everything, ghost face, scream, you know, fantastic faces, fearsome faces, uh, costume lot, Halloween mask, all the different stuff to try to get these things to pop up. And this mask right here, I am very excited about. I have another one coming um, that I really can't wait for. It. It'll be here, I'm hoping, uh, by tomorrow. And then I got another one coming on Saturday. Um, and this mask right here, I had a chance to get it a few months back from a friend. And he messaged me and said, hey, you know, I have this particular mask. You know, do you want it? But just to let you know, there's another guy I'm talking to and he's been looking for this particular mask for a really long time. Um, and he wants it really bad. And so I said, you know what? I was like, go ahead and just sell it to that guy. Um, I knew something else would come along. You know, it was obvious that he wanted it really bad. And, you know, that's what we're supposed to do in this ghost based community is, is, you know, share the wealth and, and be kind to others in the group. And this guy obviously wanted it a heck of a lot more than I did at the time. Um, and then I started getting, adding more to my collection and I kept seeing this mask and I was like, dang, you know, like I got to get this in my collection. So again, it popped up on the Facebook marketplace and for a decent price, lady said, Hey, you know, I kind of have somebody come to look at it. I was like, look, I ain't trying to be that girl. I was like, but I'll give you more and I'll give it to you right now. If you give me that mask. And she was like, well, okay. You know, so it was for a church charity that she was doing and you know, they needed money. So I was like, all right. I'll give you the money, you give me this mask, and, and sure enough, she was able to come through for me. Um, so let's peep on this, see what we got. Um, the pictures weren't too great, so I don't really know the condition unless I'm thinking of a different mask. Let's see what we've got here. Oh my gosh. You guys. <laughs> Oh, it's so pretty. Wow. All right. What out? Check that out. That, my friends, is a reshoot mask. Very, very, very beautiful mask. Um, it has some spots on it. Some green spots and things like that. You know, I'm going to, you know, get the old eraser out and try to mess around with that. Um, obviously, this mask does not need a whitening treatment by any means. Um... It's got a little bit of uh, tearing up underneath here. You can tell that a thread kind of pulled loose on it. Um, and it started to kind of unravel itself. I don't care. This mask is beautiful. And that's the thing. If you guys are true ghost face lovers and little things like this, they will not matter to you. They won't. You know, you're just happy to have it in your collection and you can appreciate it for what it is. Most people out there look at it and it's like, it's just a mask. But to, you know, me and you fellow horror fans and things like that, is more than that. So, um, little thing about these masks um, that you know most people don't know. When you're looking at the reshoot mask, you're gonna see just and my camera won't zoom in too well, but it's gonna say the Easter Unlimited right here. But besides checking at this little the eye right here, they're always wanting to be pinched down here in this left eye. Um, some of them have, you know, are a little bit more pinch than others. Um, this one is actually in very beautiful shape. Um, but to double check on that, if you look up underneath the material and you pull it back, there's a little TD up underneath right here. And I know you can't see it. My camera isn't focusing in on it too well. Um, but it is a Walgreens reshoot TD mask. Um, and this is in absolutely gorgeous condition. I am like... They look a lot different. This is my first one I've ever had. I've never even touched one before. Um, but they feel a lot different than they look in the pictures. I was expecting like this ultra white kind of feel to it, you know, really hard, but it's actually really malleable and 
Like, I'm kind of surprised, to be honest. Um, you know, besides the unraveling and everything, I mean, the, the, the mask is in great condition. There's no, uh, no other tears or anything like that. But yeah, I mean, it's just, it's just a nice thing to have in your collection. Of course, having a tag one would be the creme de la creme, but you know, when you have a chance to buy one of these things the way that I did, you snag it up and you just, you just be grateful and you just love it. So, um, anyways, well that, that is going to do it for me guys. Um, I'm glad you guys are out there uh, enjoying this stuff with me and watching my videos. I really appreciate it. The few subscribers that I do have, um, you know, this is a chance for us to, you know, we're a ghost space community, you know, we got to share our stuff with one another. So, uh, anyways, I got a couple more videos coming later in the week. So you guys just hang tight and, um, I got some really cool stuff coming. So, and no, it ain't no fantastic faces, but you know, it's still pretty darn cool. So you guys stay tuned. All right. And we'll talk to you later.